World of Tanks applying crew books. So I have a bunch of crew books for many different nations because it's holiday ops right now. For the USA, I have two training booklets and one training guide. And what I did was I know that the tank destroyers, such as a T-95, have the most crew members. And therefore, I can apply the same value against many people. And the heavy tanks, not so much because in the U.S. the higher tier heavy tanks only have a few crew members, although the lower tier ones might have a lot. So I looked at the T-28, it's only got four. The T-95 only has four. But then I found over here I've got the, uh, the E-4, which has its crew. It's got five crew members. One of them is a female crew member, four named Abbott, which are zero skill BIA and then another guy who's just a regular guy who's down in the loader position because it usually doesn't have a lot of crew skills and in this case there's two loaders so they really don't need to duplicate safe stowage and adrenaline rush so this is the ideal vehicle in my garage to put the uh, crew books on because I'm gonna get the most benefit the numbers are low, which means the lower tiers you get a higher percentage increase. And the female and the zero skill BIA is also going to be better as opposed to applying it towards a regular crew member. So I chose this vehicle. I'm going to go to uh, the training guide. You can apply them all at the same time and you can increase the quantity because in this case there's many available. But I like to apply them at one, one at a time. See, I'm not going to get much of an increase, and nothing is going to flip over 100%, so there's going to be no new crew skills. Looks like this one's going to give me two new crew skills, and it's going to equalize the first two crew members. So for this one, I would probably put, I don't know, repairs or the gun gets damaged a lot because of the type of vehicle it is. Um, dispersion during turret rotation. Yeah, this one has high dispersion, probably. So I'm going to add it. And repairs I'm not going to worry about because... Um, I used two repair kits uh, for this case I don't know maybe sound detection maybe repairs um, maybe I'll go with the sound detection I don't know if it works when it's partially trained but it used to be that you had to have it fully trained and you don't want to put those at the end because it'll take forever to research them. The ones that you have to have fully trained you want to put near the beginning. Okay, so that is how I decide how I apply them. You see the crew is a lot better now. And compared to my recruits, I really don't have any recruits that are any better. And this is pretty much... That's unusual that my crews have so few skills. Like this one has four. This one has five. When you get into France, you start to see six and seven. Like this one's got one, two, three, four, five, six. And it is on a loader, which isn't good. It should be moved up to like a commander should be swapped with a commander because he's zero skill BIA and it looks like the commander isn't but I'm not going to pay for that so I do have the retraining orders but that will be in another video okay so that's how you apply crew books if you have any questions or comments please post below